That's a perception that people have had for a long time that kangaroo is all the same, but it's no different than cattle or any other animal that we consume. It does make a difference between the breed, the feed, the sex, the age, and uh, the area it comes out of. I've been working with kangaroo for quite some time, so I've worked through pretty much every single one of the cuts. They range as much as any other animal, so you've got everything from your tougher, more flavoursome, harder working muscles, like your shoulders and especially the tail, which require a lot more cooking, and they still have that beautiful gelatinous sort of content to them, even though they don't, um, they don't carry as much fat. People describe it as gamey, but it's a bit more tangy, it's got a beautiful, fresh, juicy flavour to it. And then you get into your things like your shoulders and your forequarters and all, this, all those pieces which have got lots of, lots of nice bone through them. And even though it doesn't have that fat of lamb and goat or even beef and other meats, it still has all that connective tissue so you still get that beautiful mouth feel to it. So what we have here is a bone in side of a kangaroo. Uh, what I'll demonstrate is what the names of the, the, uh, the products is from the carcass. Uh, at this point what we're looking at is a bone in forequarter. Uh, this is uh, um, also you can get in the lamb as well as in the, in the goats, the same cuts. Here we have a bone-in rack. Again, it's, we can get the same uh, cuts out of the species of goats as well as venison, as well as uh, other lamb cuts. This one here is a uh, spine bone of a kangaroo. It's uh, very unique uh, to kangaroo only. This here we have a skin-off towel of a kangaroo. Yeah, we're having here a boneless side of kangaroo. As you can see, uh, the back straps in the kangaroo and the forequarter part, it's uh, again very similar to, to other species. The unique cuts of kangaroo, it comes from this area. We call it as a butt area. Uh, these are three muscles that are coming out of this area. They are very, very unique only to kangaroo. The muscles are very soft. As they're not overworking, the kangaroo is actually standing upright. So this is the area where it uh, works the least. Here we're having a, a leg, again very similar to lamb as well as uh, goats or, or venison. Yeah, what we have here is uh, the six cuts of loin and uh, leg of the kangaroo. Uh, the most unique part of this kangaroo are the loin fillets, strip loin and long loin. The loin fillet, uh, it's originating from this area here. We're looking at here as a long loin and a strip loin right in the middle of the carcass. The legs, we have top side where we uh, prefer to call as a inside of, a, of a meat. Uh, then we have a rump which originates from this area and then we have a silver side which comes from this area. Through your eye fillets and your top side, all those other sort of more primal, more common primal cuts um, are incredibly delicate and, and are really easy to eat raw. They love to be cooked very gently. Overcooking is probably the, you know, the biggest problem with them because they can dry out because they don't have that moisture, uh, that, that fat through them. It's specific, unique, lean, clean, delicious flavours um, is you know, what you really get when you just cook things nice and quick. You know, there's a lot more going on, there's a lot more potential to kangaroo than just thin scallops pan fried quickly or tart hair. Taking something like this and then cooking it for ages sort of sounds contradictory to you know keep cooking it quickly and keeping it lean but it really brings out really beautiful quite specific unique flavours to it. Like the tail is just wicked. You know people use it in the same way you use wood uh, an ox tail but it has a lighter flavour I find. It's mainly red kangaroo and we only use male kangaroos which gives us a lot of consistency. Paru comes out of the best regions, the best areas, the best condition. The difference is like night and day.